Hey guys, FNAF fan 2001 here. Yes, this is a very weird spot I'm doing this at, but I need it for all that stuff back there for the next video. Um, but in this video, we're going to be talking about a custom that I made that I want to get out. In my last video, I explained the entire situation. Um, basically, Mr. Springs, that was the most vid that was the most voted one on his. But since I made this in May, let me get this right, May 26th at 6.57 p.m., I have finished this custom. So if you guys don't know, this is Shadow Bonnie or um, how is it, what is he called? RW something, 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 a bunch of letters, random letters. But here he is basically how I made him. Let me turn this lighting down so you guys can actually see him. Maybe one more. So, let him try to focus. Possibly. I don't know if I can get him to focus. Sir. Thank you. Okay, so basically this is the system area toy Bonnie, but I have him repainted as regular Bonnie. Of course, you can tell by the lines on him. Um, if you don't stop making noise, I will kick you out. Okay. Anyways. Trust me, he deserves it. <laughs> I'm not kicking you out right now, stay there. Anyways, this is the System Area Toy Bonnie. Um, I have painted him all black. Oh, kind of except for the uh, legs, because you know, they're already black. But uh, as you can see, he is it's, he, one of the, to the toy that I used, that I custom, his arm was a little loose, so eh, let's do the T-pose. Um, I do gotta be careful with him because if his arms are like that and you move them forward, it does scuff up the paint a little bit, as you can see right here. But, you know, for my first custom, that's not too bad. Um, Basically, I used, um, I'll put on screen what paint I used. I used um, apple barrel black paint, and I hand painted it. I also used the white paint. I also have, um, question. You know, no, I'll put a picture of what it is. I gave him glow-in-the-dark eyes because, um, I gave him glow in the dark eyes because, uh, you know, how can I make something that's already pretty scary even more scary? Give him glow in the dark eyes. So I gave him those. Um, I, whenever I just dropped them, I chipped some of the paint. That's fun. Literally, he just needs to be repainted with some gloss. That's, and I also used primer, white primer, and uh, clear gloss. That's why he's so glossy. So yeah, that's my custom. Here's a full 360 look. I even did the gears. So yeah, that's the custom. Again, this would have been a longer video, but I haven't had time to make the actual toy animatronics. But whenever I do, he will be in there. Um, but yeah, so how I made him was I took all the pieces off individually. I got some tape and taped up this part because I didn't want, you know, whenever I spray painted, I didn't want the, um, the paint to get in there because it's going to be white. It was white primer and then I was just going to hand paint it black. That's what I did. So I didn't want these to end up white and having to go in to the inside of the ball joints and paint it 
uh, black. So I just taped those up, I taped up everything on him, and even his head. And I took about two or three days to prime him like I wanted him. And then it spent about maybe two, three hours painting him because I had to wait for it to dry. I can tell you waiting for paint to dry is like watching paint dry. That's the same. Yeah. Anyways. Um, but yeah. Uh, his mouth and eyes, that was kind of the hardest part because I had to wait for, um, it's like, I'm trying to get it to, please. Focus. 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 You're not focusing. Anyways, the uh, teeth and the eyes were the hardest because I had to use a tiny brush and paint each individual tooth. And he doesn't have a full bottom row of teeth, as you can see. So it was very, very difficult to paint. Um, and then I did two coats over the eyes with the white paint. It's just apple bottom paint or apple barrel paint or something like that. It'll be on the screen. Um, but I used that paint over his eyes and then I got some glow in the dark uh, paint. Pretty sure it's by Apple Barrel too. If not, I could be mistaken. But it was just a basic um, clear glow in the dark paint. And I painted over his eyes. And after all of that was done, I took it outside and I just sprayed them down with a gloss. And that's how we have this dude. I'm really proud of him because he is my first custom and I can't wait to see how um, Chica, uh, Freddy and System, not System Ray, Toy Bonnie come out to look like. So if you guys like this video, hit the like button down below. If you want me to do more customs, I will gladly do it. Um, but yeah, if you guys like this video, hit the like button down below and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.